Um, we see right now that the uh, GOP, a lot of uh, Republicans are all of a sudden shifting for Trump to get rid of Cruz. We're also seeing a turn of events where Palin endorsed Trump. And um, we do see still grumblings of an anti-Trump energy. So, well, yeah, with, with that, with the, the, the GOP, you got the established Republican siding with Trump, and you have the conservatives trying to take out Trump by siding with Cruz. There is really interesting. There was, um, uh, for those who may not know, I'm actually in uh, Texas at the moment, and there was an attorney here in Texas, speaking of Cruz, who had filed a um, lawsuit questioning. And I actually don't know. I don't know anything about this attorney, who he is, or what side he's on. But he was questioning the citizenship of uh, Cruz, which Trump brought out. Does that really matter now after Obama? <laughs> well, there. I mean. There, there is a difference in that Obama was born in Hawaii. Now, whether or not you want to believe his birth certificate or not, but... It, it, to me, look, to me, I, I was in law for 10 years. I was a teacher for five, and, and I'm a poor and all that. If you got nothing to hide, then show it to me. If you're not showing to me, you got something to hide. There's no big deal. I'll go get my birth certificate. You guys want to see it? I'll bring it. There's no big deal. Right, but the whole thing is his mother. Look, do you really well, want to know? Well, now, you said you said you worked in law because I did as well for ten years. The and there's, okay. there's a big issue there. If if he's eligible to run for office just because he's mother, he has one American parent, then I want to think just for a moment about the one hundred thousand children who were fathered by American servicemen in Vietnam. God only knows how many children might be half American in Iraq or Afghanistan. So if that law holds for Cruz, then that means any one of those little kids could grow up to be president too. And it also means they would be eligible to receive American benefits, including Medicaid and, you know, uh, so, you know, what do we do about that? How do we really, we need to look at what the implications of a law would be. If you say this is okay for Cruz, then it's okay for anybody who's got one American parent and can prove it. Yeah, that's a good point. Uh, the, the um, Cruz, I, if, if they can constitutionally prove that he's a citizen, then if it's proven, he, he can run. I mean, they they, if they say it's okay under the Constitution, you know. Yeah, I, I, I'm waiting to hear back from the Supremes on that one. I would, to be honest, it's going to uh, be, be that decision, you know. Um, all I have from the Constitution, I, I think the intent of the original uh, father was that they wanted you to be a citizen of the state because they didn't want you to have any allegiance to any other nation. To follow? But, so, so let's say Cruz is half Canadian, they're going to say, then he, he might have some allegiance to Canada and that is no good. He's supposed to put the U.S. first. Right. So I see what they wanted was, you know, the father to be born here, and then the son to be born here, and then the son can run for president. You know, so that right. affects Obama, Cruz, Rubio. Right. And out, he, right. he had made a comparison to John McCain and Barry Goldwater, but those were two different cases since John McCain was actually born in the U.S. Canal Zone. And to two American parents, his father was serving in the military, but the Canal Zone was a U.S. jurisdiction at the time. I have a friend who was a uh, U.S. citizen because he was born on a, on, on a, a U.S. naval boat. Right, right, or, or a military base, if you're, yeah. you know, right. so that's, that's, these are all, you know, questions, you know. Yeah. Well, I, well, just, I, got, I just got a text. I, and they're saying, I just got a text. All the people you mentioned... They were born in America. Cruz was not born in America. How do you guys feel about that? Straight, just straight, straight shooting that one. I'll let the Supreme Court decide. Yeah, I'm going to go with the same answer because I, I, you know, again, I think there is a real, there are other issues we have to consider that if, again, if they do say it's okay because he's got one American parent, then that would extend right to rights to anybody who has one American parent, regardless of where they are right now. 
So I think they have a lot to consider when they decide that case, which hopefully will be soon. Well, well you know why that's so important? Because it's really between Trump and Cruz right now. Right, right, exactly, so exactly. If Cruz out, Trump's leader. Did we got a text from Trump? 